Welcome to Comic Basic Star Wars, where we try to teach you everything we know about Star Wars in three minutes or less. Today's character, Asajj Ventress. We know of Dooku's plot to turn the huts against us. It will not succeed. It will when the truth dies with you. Born into Mother Talson's night sisters, Asajj Ventress was taken from her sisters at a very young age. Her kidnapping was done by Halstead. Eventually, Halstead met his demise, and upon her release, she was found by the one-stranded Kai Narek. Seeing that she was Force-sensitive, Kai Narek took her on as the Padawan, and together the two protected the planet of Rat Attack. Sadly, just like Halstead, Kai Narek met his demise, and the aftermath of his death left Ventress filled with rage, loss, and grief. These feelings overwhelmed her, and she began to embrace the dark side of the Force. Her power would not go unnoticed, and within a short period of time, Count Dooku took her upon as his Sith apprentice. Unfortunately, he would not teach her all that he knew, and she became merely a tool utilized to carry out assassinations and other events not worthy of a Sith apprentice. These events led her, on more than one occasion, to encounter the Jedi's Obi-Wan Kenobi and Anakin Skywalker. Afraid that Dooku and Ventress would rise up and overpower him, Dooku's master, Darth Sidious, ordered she be slain. Barely escaping her former master's assault, Asajj Ventress made her way back to her home planet of Dathomir, where she rejoined her night sisters. This didn't stop Dooku, and eventually he ordered General Grievous and his droid army to Dathomir. As a byproduct of the order, Ventress's sisters were all destroyed and she was left as merely a shell of what she once was. Now without family or friends, Ventress took upon the life of a bounty hunter. As a bounty hunter, she came into contact with her eventual love and Jedi master, Queen Lynn Voss. She learned that he had been sent to murder her former master, Count Dooku, and quickly partnered with him to carry out the deed. You are no match for me without the aid of your monster. That remains to be seen. As you wish. Sadly, after being taken prisoner by Dooku and tortured for months, Voss gave himself to the dark side. At her end, Ventress sacrificed her life for Voss and was peacefully laid to rest back on her home planet. If you like this video, do me a favor and subscribe down below. If you really like it, give it a share. Thanks, until next time.